Hey everyone, so DeepSeek R1 has been making waves in the cybersecurity world with many asking on how will it impact the threat landscape and while it's a powerful AI model, the reality is more complex than that, of course. And, and to understand the cybersecurity implication, we need to look at two versions of DeepSeek. There is the DeepSeek R1, the full model, and this is an expensive model. It requires at least one terabyte of uh, RAM and high-end NVIDIA H100 GPUs to run. Extremely resource-intensive and slow on anything but enterprise-grade infrastructure, out of which for most of the cyber uh, criminals, except nation-state actors or well-founded uh, cybersecurity organizations or threat organizations. The second one is distilled uh, models, a lighter, faster alternative. And, and this model are trained on DeepSeek R1 outputs, meaning they don't have full reasoning abilities, but retain some efficiency. Now, they have lower competential requirements, so they can run uh, on a high-end consumer let laptop or personal GPU setup. They are slightly better than the existing open source AI model, but it's it's not it's nothing revolutionary. Um, definitely not a leap for uh, hackers. This is why some claim they can run DeepSeek R1 on a laptop. They are actually running a distilled uh, version with reduced capabilities. So who will use uh, what? So lower tiers threat actors and cyber criminals definitely will use uh, distilled uh, models. Again, they have small efficiency gains in AI assistant attack, but nothing groundbreaking, as I mentioned. Potential use cases can be automated phishing emails, which will be slightly better tech generation for social engineering. It can be malware generation, credential stuffing and password uh, uh, attacks. Advanced threat actors, like nation state or APT groups will use definitely the full DeepSeek R1. Their major use cases will be disinformation and AI generated uh, botnets, AI powered uh, spear phishing and faster malware con, uh, customization. So what's uh, next in my mind? Um, I don't think that DeepSeek R1 is an immediate uh, threat for cybersecurity, but the distilled version may offer incremental improvement for cyber criminals looking for a low-cost AI-assisted attack.